Good morning. I got a message for the boys masquerading as men before I hit this treadmill this morning. Sisters, close your ears. You don't want to listen to this. This is for the brothers. You know, the Bible says that the woman is to be a help meet to the man. The Quran says that she is to bring consolation of peace and tranquility, a peace of mind to the man. Well, how can she help you meet an obligation when you don't have no purpose? How can the woman help you meet your obligation and you don't have no direction? How can the woman help you meet your goals in life and you depending on her to have goals and mad at her when she doesn't have goals for the family? It's your job. How can you bring the sister bring consolation to your mind and you're sitting around crying and whining about what you can't do and what they won't let you do and who won't let you be who you're supposed to be? You see, there are so many men today, you got to push them, you got to prod them. You got to encourage them to go in the right direction, to have a purpose. I say we have some weak back men today. They're boys making masquerading as men. That's one thing to give them a compliment. That's another thing to give them a, a diaper and a putting a bottle in their mouth. I just want to talk to you today. I had this on the mind. We need some strong men today. We need conscious men today who are going to have a backbone instead of a neck bone, always whining and crying about their condition. We got to stop looking for a handout and look for a hand up. Our women are frustrated because they can't motivate you. You have some big old grown babies without an assignment, without purpose, without goals. And you wonder why she don't love you. You wonder why she doesn't admire you because you are a spoiled brat. And you need to go back home to your mama where she can breastfeed you in the nourishment of becoming a man. It's one thing to need encouragement. It's another thing to need a diaper because you're still a boy masquerading as man. I'm just talking to the men today. You can rebut all you want. I want to talk to you. Too many men are sitting around crying and whining about what the sisters are not doing for them. What are you doing? I just want to talk to you today. Take the bottle out of your mouth, put some gloves on and go to work. Sacrifice for yourself, sacrifice for your family, sacrifice for the bare well-being of your babies. Sitting at home watching TV all day. Yes, I'm angry. I'm passionate about this. She don't tell me she love me enough. Love your doggone self and she'll love you. She'll you a thing about a woman, she'll go to heaven or hell for a man that she loves, but she can't love a man who ain't doing nothing, who ain't going nowhere, who won't have a purpose. God created man to have power. She's attracted to power. She's attracted to security. She's attracted to somebody who has a direction. You can't even make a decision for the family because you are terrified. <laughs> I'm going to get a workout, man. I just wanted to come and talk to you. I talk to men all the time. They can't get their eyes off the floor. Scared of their own shadow. Boys masquerading as men. And I'll conclude with this. If you're playing sports for six hours and you're reading for 30 minutes, you're still a boy. If you have more stereo equipment in your apartment than you have books in your library, you're still a baby. If you playing PlayStation while other people are building space stations, you're an agent to your own suicide. So don't come crying to me. 
Come to me and let me do your last rites because you all already dead. Boys masquerading as men. I'm done. Woo!